Arizona is known for its spectacular geology, but it also has some secrets, like a hole that swallows a river, sinkholes that can fit a football stadium, vast underground spaces that breathe with changes in the atmosphere, and bottomless fractures in the earth. Formations like these are scattered all over our corner of the state. What causes these cracks, and what is hidden in the darkness? A small group of students at Snowflake Junior High School plan to use technology to explore deep in the earth. To do this, we need to create a new breed of remote control vehicle. With the help of community members, we designed and cut metal parts, made custom circuit boards, and coded microcontrollers. Many of our parts needed to be fabricated because commercial components were not a good fit for our project. Teamwork, purpose, and problem solving helped us complete tasks that we didn't think were possible. There were many challenges along the way, but seeing our product come to life was encouraging. To finish it off, we used a combination of traditional woodworking and modern vacuum plastic forming. We've named our robotic exploration vehicle the Kraken. A local pilot helped us map and locate the best places to explore with our creation. We took several field trips to different locations. We traveled down miles of highway and dirt roads, and when it got too rough, we hiked. We chose not to use battery power because it would greatly reduce our exploration time. Instead, we used an AC generator on the surface and powered it through a tether. This gives us hours of uninterrupted exploration. We used a system of ropes and pulleys to lower our device, the Kraken, to the bottom. Live video footage and control signals were sent through a Cat5 Ethernet cable to a laptop where we piloted the vehicle. It was exciting to see what was in the darkest depths. Who knows what we will find in the miles of cracks left to explore. We believe our device could be useful in other situations like search and rescue in earthquake rubble and collapsed sinkholes. In southern Arizona, 160 miles of a new type of crack is forming. Increased water demands, drought, and unsustainable groundwater pumping has drastically lowered aquifer levels. Without the support of the groundwater, 3,400 square miles of Arizona is sinking, compacting the soil and permanently reducing the aquifer's capacity, which is another problem that must be solved for tomorrow.